Yeah. Hey loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you don't know who I am, my name is Don Kennedy. Go ahead and subscribe because you're gonna love it here. If you're new here, girl, thank you for coming back and showing me some love. So as you're seeing from the title and the thumbnail, I'm gonna show y'all how to do my in-depth makeup routine, which is the most complimented makeup routine that I do when I go out. Yeah, this is the most complimented. That's all I was trying to say. Okay, cool. So with no further ado, let's just get straight into this video because we get the point. Okay, y'all, so today, like I told y'all, we're about to get into my everyday in-depth makeup routine, but we're trying different makeup brushes. So today we have a travel pack, y'all. Like, y'all understand how hot this makes me because I'm in my going little trips era, okay? So keep everything very compact, and I don't want just to have extra stuff, heavy bags. So this is a start for, like, my little mini, you know? Look at this, y'all. Like, look at the little brushes. They're so freaking cute. Obviously, I got mine in um, pink. It's just so girly and cute. And the brand that I did get this from is BS Mall. Y'all, the highlight of it. It has a freaking lid mirror. Ah! Who not gonna be doing their makeup on a plane? I'm gonna be doing my makeup on a plane. I'm gonna be doing my skincare on a plane. Like, I'm going to literally be like, Yo, okay? So I told y'all, oops, am I touching it? I'm not even touching it. I told y'all I was gonna tell you what this is for. This is a charger for your lit light, y'all, and this is so freaking cute. And all the different brushes that come with, you have a powder brush, angle brush. I actually have the bigger sizes of these, so it's really cute. You have your angle brush, your flat brush, um, angle detail brush, okay, eyebrow combination brush, um, flame brush, precise of crease brush, Eyelash brush, lip brush, detail brush, um, flat angle eyeshadow brush, eyeshadow brush, concealer brush, classic eyeshadow brush, okay? So you get all of that in here. This is so cute. I just love this, okay? So yeah, thank you, BS Mall, for gifting me this, y'all. This is so cute, so just girly. And it does come in the colors of black, white, and pink, okay? And also, I will leave the description to this in the bottom, so you can go ahead and order yours. Okay, so no further ado. Oh, it twists. It literally twists. Like, wait. Ugh, I'm obsessed. Okay, so let's get into this video. So first you have to do your skincare routine. I actually just posted a video of my skincare routine, which is what I did right before I made this video. So make sure you look at that video if y'all want to see like that under foundation that I, or that under base that I did to get this, this look. So my primer that I get go in with is e.l.f. Y'all, as you can see, I need more. So we are about to squeeze this out. And a little goes a long way with this product, y'all. You don't need a lot. I, I don't put it all on my my forehead. I just kind of like put whatever excess is on my fingers and rub it in and just make sure you get the corner. Just make sure you get the corner of your nose, okay? Like, I don't think nobody understands how important that is, okay? Next. So next, I'm gonna go in with my concealer. The concealer I use is Born This Way and it's in the shade Sand. Can y'all see that? Yeah, I think it was probably backwards. So, like, I'm never really too heavy handed. And we're just gonna draw it like out. And we're just gonna feel this. And yes, I go on the side of my nose, y'all. Okay. This is actually the one that's going out. So, let me get the other one. Same shade, though. Same shade. Yeah, this is a new one. Okay. And we're just gonna draw her out. And then we're gonna put like a line here, halfway. And then we're gonna just draw her in a little dot. Now we're gonna come into the contour. So the contour I use, I never really knew how to like say this name, but I love this contour, y'all. This contour stick. And this is the shade AU Chocolate. Chocolate. I'm not sure how you say it, but I believe I got this from like Ulta. But anywho, so. We're just gonna draw it and we're gonna stop there. Y'all see what I did? And we're gonna take it on the forehead and we're gonna go here. And as you can see, I have like a few edges down. So I'm going around it because you can literally just blend that in, okay? And we just stop right there. 
And then I'm gonna go on the side of my nose with the contour stick and we're just gonna draw a line here and there. And also, we're gonna put like this little line, a little, you know, across our eyes. I like my makeup to be very like brown, bronze, just, you know, I think that's a beautiful color. So this is the brush I'm using. So I just like kind of slant it. And we're just gonna go in and we're just gonna like, you know, rub it through. Like, it's like a mixture of patting and rubbing. Cause you know, and you wanna get as close to your hairline as possible. You could dab it on like your edges, like right here too, it doesn't matter. I pick my edges up at night, so the whole face will get washed. I do my edges every day. Now for the girlies that, you know, they don't do their edges every day, you don't have to do that. Like it's not like a big show cause you're gonna, you're gonna come back and you're gonna um, use powder, bronzer when you finish. Okay, so we got that blended. Then we're gonna go on our eyes and blend that out. Spread her on out. Let me see. I just love this shade for, for real. It wasn't here on me, but I got it. Ignore those lines. We're gonna take this brush and we're just gonna like draw it up our nose and we're gonna draw it all the way to that crease. Like this crease right here, y'all. That's how you get that nose to just be. Now granted, I have like, the more I do my makeup, the more I OD with my nose contour, but I'll show you guys how to have like a less of, you know, that, that strong, you know, dramatic look. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with this brush to blend my concealer. Okay, that one's kind of like too, oh, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, blends really nice. Okay, nice brushes. Yeah. Okay, that was a nice blend, I like that. So we're just gonna blend, and when you're blending your makeup, like the concealer, I'm sorry, you start from bottom up, like don't go straight into the top. Like, you know, you start up, blend down here, and then work your way up into under eye part. And I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna drag it all the way out. Remember I'm saying this is just simply my everyday makeup routine. So I feel like if I drag it out, that's like when I'm gonna go out like and I want like a more like, I actually got my makeup done kind of look. Snatched, okay. Put the excess here. Then we're gonna go on the nose. We're gonna blend her out. And we're gonna build her up to the forehead. And if y'all hear that little popping noise, it's just my, um, it's just my candle burning next to me. And it smells so good. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's that. So next we're gonna get into my foundation, y'all. Okay, my biggest secret is I don't use foundation. I haven't used foundation in over a year. I only use the Ease Dry Blurring Skin Tint by Fenty Beauty in the shade 12, y'all. If they ever took this away, I don't know what I would do, literally. And with this stuff, I use an egg, or I'm sorry, with this stuff, I use a blending brush and you only need a little, literally, y'all see that, that one dot. And then if you need more as you go, perfectly fine. But the you want that the airbrush look. So we're gonna do the other side just a little. One dot. Okay. Yeah. You want that airbrush look. You want that look like it looks like you have no makeup on, but you look so flawless that you know I know you did your face. Like who did your face? Like and I think that would get this makeup look so many compliments. Or people think that. You know, I'm a makeup artist. Like literally, like all my friends are doing makeup all the time. When I go out, people are like, oh my God, who do your makeup? You do your makeup, do you do makeup? Like you should start doing makeup. And I'm like, no babies, you know, that's not my thing, but I just found techniques that, you know, work for me. And I was talking to my friends, makeup is no problem. And I'm gonna just come around also and go over my nose to blend that out. So this is for the girls that do not want that harsh, you know, makeup line contour look on your 
your um, nose, sorry. So next I'm gonna go in with the Laura Mercier, I think I'm saying it right, and the translucent powder. And that's how we're gonna do this. I'm just gonna get a little, you know, regular one too. I like to blow it off when I dip it. I'm gonna look up, okay. And I do draw like a straight line. Like I pat a straight line. I'm not gonna say I wipe. I pat a straight line. And from there, I push it in. I don't bake. I literally just push it in my skin. And I feel like that plays a big part also too in the airbrush finish look, okay? And then we're gonna dab this wherever you put concealer. I know a lot of people like to dab it wherever they have, they sweat the most. I don't, I don't know, that's just me. If you do it, I'm not saying stop doing it, do what works for you. Makeup is like mad, there's a many ways to get the same number, okay? Before we wipe that off, we're gonna go in with the eyebrows and I use the Anastasia, Anastasia I guess, brow wiz and dark brown. I actually need another one, oh my God, I hate this for myself. Okay, so for the brows, I haven't like went over my, I usually get on here and just do have my brows done already or do it without y'all looking. Look at this. Okay, first you're gonna need a valid pencil. Y'all see there's no tip there. Like, y'all see that? Oh God. So I'm just gonna go light because it's probably gonna be the last time I'm able to use this. So I draw out, like I start like a little before where my eyebrow actually starts. And we're gonna go out. And I'm gonna just do both eyes since you know the eyebrow pencil is so like disappearing on me. Yeah. And then we're just gonna I shape my own eyebrows. You can see I really don't have a tail. You can always follow yours, but I like this shape of eyebrows. Wish I could have this shape of eyebrows. If you have this shape of eyebrows, girl, you're blessed. And I just fill in where I don't have hairs. And then I come to the front and I draw in right. I'm gonna just fill in. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna take the got to be glue. And if you have like an eyebrow, you know, glue, I mean gel, that's fine. I'm gonna spray got to be on the spoolie area. And we're gonna lightly, like not hard, but lightly brush our hairs up, which gives that like clean, sleek look. Oh, where is it? Okay, the other side. And I'm gonna have to go back in because I wipe some off. Lord, let it come off, please. Yeah, this brow pencil is done, y'all. It's kind of making me sad. I don't wanna go buy another one. We got we do our bronzer. So I do use the one size palette, and this is the Dark Trio. It has the legendary, the second one is Press Rec, and the third is Back Row. So we're gonna go in with the legendary, which is the top one. We're gonna lightly, and we're not gonna go all the way down. We're gonna keep it right up here in that little cheekbone area. And we're gonna pat all in the middle of our brow, um, our brow, our forehead, just to get it blended, okay? And we're gonna also do our, well, I don't even know what this is, collarbone, I don't know, <laughs> okay? But then, no, we're not gonna stop there, y'all. We're gonna go back in with their eyeshadow brush, BS Small. And we're gonna take that same color that we just had, and we're gonna put it on our eyelids, okay? Oh, this is a nice brush. This is a really good brush, it's so soft. Okay, and then we're gonna come in that corner and we're gonna draw down. Now, you don't have to do this step. This is what I do because I said, you know, I did a little harsh, little contour nose thing. And it's just, you know, this works for me. I like it, so. Yeah. So then, we're gonna come back around and we're just gonna brush all this excess translucent powder off with my B Small brushes. And we're gonna go with the shade Back Row. Oh, I got makeup all on me. Which is the darkest at the bottom. So we're gonna go for the under eye. I just think like that dark brown under eye little look, it always gives like a little pop of your eye no matter what eye color you have. It just always just does the job for me. Oh, 
okay so this is basically that part um you can add lashes or not add lashes today i'm not gonna add lashes i usually would do lashes but it doesn't matter today i'm like, kind of like running out of lashes so i'm not gonna do are you am i gonna do lashes today i'm not gonna do lashes today but i am gonna do a lip okay so hold on hold on i missed steps i'm gonna go in with my finishing powder and medium powder and i do like my light it also helps with that bright under eye look now keep in mind if you want to do lashes you always can add lashes like it's no problem it's just i'm just liking the no lash look lately like i don't know next i'm gonna go in with chestnut by mac hold on i'm gonna just get like a q-tip to wipe my lip mask off so it could be good okay so i do like to overline my lip show Not a lot, just a tad a bit. Okay. And just push your lips in. If you can push your lips in, just get like a little brush and just like rub it together, like just blend it. And then I'm gonna go in with the Remedy by Ari set. So we're gonna be mixing the Butter Gloss and the Barely There. So the Butter Gloss is like a little new little shade. Oh, I love this. Then we're gonna go with the Barely There, which is clear. I'm gonna tap this, because I don't believe I can get my, my brush dirty for real. What other colors? And there we have it. So not finished yet, okay? Not finished yet. My finishing spray or setting mist by Morphe, y'all. This, stop playing. Mm. Every makeup artist that ever did my makeup, they use this. Makeup stays on all them, all day. Okay? So that is the end of this video, y'all. If y'all enjoyed this video, please go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe to y'all's YouTube channel. Don't forget to turn on this post notification button so you do next time I upload another video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.